Storm Shield weather, certified most accurate. <laughs> Oh, and did he? Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist Brandon Willie. A cold Saturday for us and still it looks fairly cold for tomorrow on your Sunday and the morning low Monday could be all the way down to the teens around the Tulsa area. Temperatures now into the 30s to close to 40 degrees in some locations. I have Sepulpa now at 37 on our weather bug network and the winds all less than about 5 miles per hour. Your current temperature at the Tulsa International Airport, a cold one at 36 degrees degrees and the wind is up to about three miles per hour. Breezy conditions coming back to our forecast for tomorrow. Temperatures now across the region from the 20s to the 30s right at the freezing point for our viewers in Tahlequah at 32 degrees, upper 20s in Bartlesville and 31 in Venita and 32 in Grove. Well, the official daytime high today in Tulsa, it reached 40 degrees briefly this afternoon with that cold start all the way down into the upper 20s in the wind speed and direction. The wind is all less than about five across the region, but breezy northerly winds come in as a cold front comes in from the north for tomorrow to end the weekend. You can see on the latest series of satellite pictures with the radar, this cold front came through today, bringing us some snow across parts of our viewing area, especially the southern zones. So clearing skies overnight tonight as that front continues to pull away from the region. And then for tomorrow, that Arctic cold front comes in from the north, bringing those cold northerly winds into the mix, and we could see a few snow flurries from time to time. Timing things out on future track clouds and precipitation overnight tonight again clearing skies setting the stage for those cold overnight lows and then for tomorrow on your Sunday watch as that Arctic front pushes in from the north bringing those winds between about 10 and 25 miles per hour and that sets the stage for we could see a few snow flurries out there the atmosphere will be moist enough out there and we'll see clearing skies overnight tomorrow night again we could see that low in Tulsa by Monday morning at about 13 above overnight lows tonight from the teens to the 20s, sky took at 24 degrees, Pawhuska at 21, light winds all less than about 5 miles per hour. The sunrise coming up at 733. It's going to be a gray one, mostly cloudy skies tomorrow. Those overnight lows into the 20s, Muskogee at 24 degrees by morning. A little bit warmer in some locations to the far south here. Holdenville, not by much, almost at 30 degrees coming in at 28. So here's a look at your hourly planner for tomorrow. Mostly cloudy skies, a chance for snow flurries, daytime highs only into the 30s. High temperatures out there for the far north from the 20s to the 30s. Claremore at 35 degrees. Prior at 36 in that cold northerly wind tomorrow as that Arctic front pushes from north to south tomorrow and a chance for some snow flurries with a little bit of sunshine across the southern zones here for the morning, quickly increasing those clouds as that cold front comes into green country. And here's a look at your seven day forecast. You can see unsettled weather for next week on Tuesday. Some rain showers at 47 degrees. The wind between about 5 and 15 miles per hour. A break, Stephen, on Wednesday. A stronger system looks to come in on Thursday, bringing heavier rain showers. And then another break for Friday and Saturday. More sunshine and warmer high temperatures on the way for next week. But 13 there for Monday morning in town. Not a great low temperature there, I got to say. Not yeah. a fan of that. Yeah, and again, we could see some snow flurries tomorrow. All right, Brandon, thanks for the warning. Now it's time for sports.